pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America. We all have to recognize that most of us don't get here on our own. We have family, we have friends, we have others who have lifted us. So let's give a round of applause, graduates, to the people who have helped bring you here today. Because America was never great unless we had great iron workers. We're not going to be great in the future unless we have high caliber, high talent iron workers who can respond to any challenge that we need in California or the United States of America. And journeymen. That sounds pretty good, huh? Not an apprentice anymore, you're journeymen. We'll go down in history as the greatest union, unionist of this decade. The president of the state of California Construction and Building Trades, the Honorable Robbie Honor. And I remember walking in in 1978 through the doors of Local 433 over in Atlantic Boulevard, and I looked above the sign into the hall, and it said, through these doors walk the greatest union people in the world. And they were right. That's where the greatest union people in the world were. Iron Workers Local 433. They were also the greatest iron workers. I had to find a new gear when I got to, new, to Los Angeles to keep up with the iron workers over there. Our contract says there is no limit to the amount of work we will do in a day. And we do that. We use the least amount of people, we do the project in the least amount of time, we do it once, we do it right, we do it on to the lowest bid. And we win that fight every single day. So I'd ask all the young men back there, when your time comes, play your part in the union, because that's what makes us, it's the strength of who we are. We're about the working people. We're about the kid at the bottom. We were those kids at one time. We care about working people. That's who we are. Not only do we build them the most efficiently and the best, we also do it by giving kids, blue collar kids at the bottom that don't stand a chance, giving them a job where they can have a little family, where they can buy a home, where they stand a chance in life. We couldn't have a better ally and a better brother than the Iron Workers of 416 because it's us and them back to back against the world. And we will put hundreds of thousands of kids and their families in the middle class, but it's only us can do it together. Thank you. Uh, it's my honor to be able to take roll call one more time for the guys. Uh, I'd like to call up uh, Brian Burks, Paul Carranza, Ed Carrillo. Stephen Pruitt. Constitution and bylaws. 